What's up, y'all? It's no joke. Cow. We're coming at you live from the Hefa Lump Cafe here in Sin Madaram Mandokiri Province, Cambodia. Uh, this is the like probably like the one and only place that I that I found in this little town that I actually like going to. Uh, it's actually nice to go to. Um, I got here last night on a taxi. Now I know I told you guys I was riding my bicycle up here, and I did actually ride my bicycle a lot of the way. Uh, yesterday I rode for about eight, like eight eight and a half hours I'd say and I made it further than I thought I would I made it about I'd say about 150 kilometers ish yeah about about 150 uh, I actually checked on Google Maps so I actually put a pretty good dent in my trip but my back started really hurting a lot and my body was uh it like 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 my bike is not made to be taken on ventures that long man like 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 it was killing my legs and my back and I just figured you know what man like I might, I might injure myself doing this. It, you know, it, it, it's just not worth it. So I'm just gonna catch a taxi, and I did. I got here last night, and since I got here, man, I've just I haven't been having very good experiences. Um, like today, I mean, it's it's already at like 5 p.m. and 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 like this is the only place I I come to that seems any bit comfortable. Um, like a lot of the places that serve food around here, uh, they don't even have food to serve. So it's like you know, it's like hard to get a. a a decent meal here and even when you do it's more expensive than in Phnom Penh like I've been eating like pork and rice and just the same shit I always do and it's it's been like like 25% more expensive and I try like I try to haggle but they're just not having it man and apparently it's because a lot of rich white people come here and they just assume that because you're white you have lots of money and you probably do have more money than these people but it's still fucked up that they're charging you all that so I'm definitely not cool with that um the guest house I'm staying at's okay I'm unable to sleep there. Uh, it's it, there. It's there's like chickens next door, and they're and they're cockadoodle they're cockadoodle doing all damn night, and they don't they don't seem to care. So I mean, um, and yeah, I mean the people here just it's just weird. There's just a weird vibe here, dude. And I'm not I'm not saying that nobody should come here. I'm just saying that me personally, I, I just have not had a good experience here so far. And tomorrow I'm catching a taxi up to Bon Lung. Uh, that might be, uh, I'm not sure if I like, pronounced that the right way, but it's called Bon Lung and it's in the Ratanakri province. And they've got this cool volcano lake and my, my friend Eileen's been there uh, several times, I believe. Um, and she, you know, she likes going up there. So I'm going to check that out and hopefully that, that's, that's a cooler town. Uh, it's called Bon Lung, B-A-N-L-U-N-G, uh, up, up there in the Ratanakri province. So it's like, it's like a two, three hour ride up there. And that's where I'm going to spend the next few days, and hopefully it goes well. I'm going to take some videos there by the by the volcano lake, which should be awesome. So I don't know, y'all. Like I, I, I just wanted to give you guys like a little recap or like a little update on what I'm up to. Um, yeah. So overall, my time here in uh, Sin Sin Monoram. Damn, I always fuck that up. Sin Monoram. <laughs> Pardon me. Um, it just hasn't been very positive. I mean, like it's a nice landscape up here. But like I said, I mean, there's not much. There's just nothing to do, man. It's just, it's just, it's just not very. It's, it's not much to do here, and everything's so spread out. And I just don't feel like getting hustled by these people, you know, because they, because they know that they can. And on top of that, my fucking bicycle got a flat tire, and there's nobody in this town that could fix it. There's nobody in this town that that that, that could fix my bicycle that I've been able to find so far. So I'm stuck without a bike for now. Um, you know, so yeah, man, it, it's been a tough last couple days but uh yeah man so on top of that too i haven't been able to sleep for the last few days uh i didn't maybe maybe in the last three days i've gotten about six hours of sleep total so that's why i look so out of it right now and i've been smoking lots of weed as well so that probably has something to do with it uh but this place that i'm at right now called heffalump cafe is actually really good it's they've, they've got like you see they, they've got like the french press and all this now this was three bucks it was like a, this Thai coffee, and it was delicious. It was, it was absolutely uh, delicious, man. All the food here is like handmade, uh, and they're also partners with the Elephant Valley Project, which is cool. It's a noble cause, so they're they're pretty nice guys here. Um, and I'm glad I found this place. So if you guys are in this province, definitely check out Hefa Lump Cafe. It's a very good coffee shop. Guys that work here are super super nice, and it's a really really chilled out place to hang out. And uh, the the only place that I know of in this town to get like a legit cup of coffee. Cause uh, Kamai coffee is bullshit, dude. It's 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 like sweet milk with a little bit of coffee and a shit ton of ice. So it's really really kind of disappointing. So when you come here, you can definitely count on a good cup of coffee. I'm trying to think that if, if there's anything else I can say. I'm I'm definitely gonna try to get some more videos soon of like the nature here and 
support of the people, but I've just been so out of it and so like upset today. I just uh, I just really haven't had the I guess the, the like the mindset to make a video. So, anyways, y'all, like I hope this video didn't bore you, but I'm gonna continue to make better ones. Um, once my mood picks up, I'm just not in a very good mood right now, to be honest. So, anyways, y'all, um, I'm Mojo Coward. Peace.